I love The Last of Us 2. I love The Last of Us 2 so much that the very thought of playing it runs shivers through my body in subtle but impressive shock waves as an electric eel would if it were used in stimulating the more sensitive parts of the human anatomy. A gripping but flawed tale of heroic lesbians, homophobes, gays, bi's, and a few cues wrapped in for the morally challenged that demand an all-inclusive cast of colors, creeds, and species. Sadly, no dinosaurs and no prominent black, brown, or yellow people are essential to the plot of this all-white cast. Yes, let us complain some more. Sarcasm completed, hate speech flag averted. Spoiler, this will po spoil the story. If you haven't played The Last of Us 2, do not watch this video, do not like this video, do not share this video, do not comment or bother telling me what you think of this video. In fact, do not do anything that I have told you to do. Let us begin. A heterosexual man named Joel is bludgeoned to death by a roid raging gender blender named Abby. In the midst of this erotic bloodletting, a dim-witted, transphobic lesbian named Ellie cries and screams out for revenge as she lays witness to her hetero friend and non-sexual sugar daddy figurehead. For some inexplicable reason, the transphobic Ellie is left alive by the roid abuser and sexy muscle lady Abby to trench through an 11 to 245 hour journey of walking, shooting and low quality cutscene fucking to reach a final confrontation. Ellie and Abby never have sex and resolve their deep-seated phobic and societal issues of injustice that rose from the death of one very old heterosexual man. In fact, there is no intercourse of any kind, just a tease of two phobic people bitch-slapping each other till one decides I will no longer bitch-slap you because I am bleeding and this is taking too damn long. The end. In conclusion, The Last of Us 2 is good. It's so good that should you try fornicating with an electric eel by sticking it in parts unknown, you will feel the same set of emotions that this game will penetrate you with. If you are racist, this will not change your mind. If you seek social justice, this will enrage you. Death Stranding Voyeurism plus Last of Us 2 developer sex cutscene equals profit 4 million units sold.